Yes, talking about common experiences to draw a connecting point for stories, um, a good example was for us in London uh, in the past, it was the Olympic Games was happening, high profile, lots on the media about it, schools were encouraged to talk about it, there were programmes already out there, but not much was happening on the sort of connecting with faith stuff. So Barnabas in schools uh, devised some, some materials so that it started with that common excitement about the world coming to our part of the world, uh, the excitement of uh, races and achievement and winning and what, what, how do you become a winner and all those sorts of things. Um, and then we began to reflect as a team, well, of course, those images of racing and running and achieving and winning, although we might need to redefine winning, but winning are there in the Bible too. Certainly, St. Paul uses those images very powerfully to describe the journey, the race, the Christian race. So we began to put those two together. So starting with the values that were in, in sporting values, uh, we, we, we transferred them over. Well, what does that have to say about running the bigger race of life? Um, and so using the common experience, we then were able to, say, were able to say, well, look, this is true. We can see it in our lives now. And a lot of us have sporting loves and, and hates, <laughs> whatever, but it gets us excited. Um, what does that say to us about becoming someone of faith or discovering about faith? Does it also need determination? <laughs> uh, does it need dependence, working, on, working together? Um, what does victory mean, actually, in a, in a faith sense? It's a, um, and how do we become winners uh, in that sense? So what makes a winner is a good common connecting point between the Commonwealth Games in, in, in Scotland next year uh, and the story of faith in the Bible. Um, so we, we picked up several stories. The one I loved most, um, I'll just say this, and I used it lots in schools, um, was the story of the four friends bringing their one friend to Jesus on, on, on the bed because he was paralysed. And it was their determination, their teamwork, um, their faith in that this man would do something, they're not being put off by the crowds that could, you know, were at the door, the, the ingenious solutions they found about going up the top of the house on the flat roof and getting away down, the shock of, of what happened when the roof opened. Brilliant for drama in schools. And there's actually a wonderful poem. Um, I often quoted this, not to the children, but with teachers in training. Seamus Hina, who's died very recently, he wrote a poem about this very particular miracle called Miracle. It's worth looking up sometime. And uh, he, at the, point, the punch of the poem is the real miracle wasn't so much the man was healed, wonderful that uh, that was, it was the teamwork of the friends. That was an amazing miracle. Um, and that was a really connecting point. And we need each other on the journey of life, however we describe it, particularly the faith journey. I mean, churches are at their best, a team encouraging each other on the journey of faith. And so we made those connections with a common experience. We, we produced material for this for the Olympics, in, gone, gone now, but we realised the value of what we had is something that could be just tweaked a bit, so it was not just Olympic branded, but it was any big sports event. So uh, we, we're calling it uh, What Makes a Winner. Um, and there are stories, in it. this is a book, first of all, um, and there are suggested outlines for uh, what you could do in the classroom to explore this uh, and some, uh, some acts of religious worship you do with, with this. Um, and then uh, but there's also other materials will be online as well. You can just download for yourself. So this is a Barnabas in Schools. It's worth going there to see, uh, see what's available. Not that you will use everything exactly like that, but it might inspire you to make that connection between uh, a common experience and the faith experience, which um, needs nurturing and rediscovering in many of us, but is there for many people and needs some, some, some props to help, you, help us understand it, which the, um, the games does. <laughs> Good. <laughs>